So my name is Svilen, and I'm one half of the Wrangell of Brothers. And together with my brother, who's an aerospace engineer, uh, I'm obviously the economist, we, we are building an airplane. And uh, it's not just the two of us. We have some great people who are very knowledgeable in the sphere. Uh, some of his former professors at the Technical University of Delft in the Netherlands, as well as some uh, world-class logistics professionals. Why are we building an airplane? It's a special type of airplane. It's a cargo airplane because uh, cargo currently is very inefficient. On average, every cargo flight is half empty, uh, which means that uh, we're paying double where we could be paying much less. Um, airlines are doing much to, uh, to recover from that. And one of their approaches is to use different sizes of aircraft. When they anticipate demand, they have uh, complicated software that tells them if today is a busy day or if today is going to be a slow day. But even if you know when it's a slow day, you're stuck with uh, whatever size aircraft you, you have in your hangar. So um, we're building a smaller building block. We're building an aircraft that we call the Black Swan uh, that has no man, no pilot on board because it allows us to achieve tremendous savings. And uh, it's able to carry 350 kilograms over 2,500 kilometers. And because of all the tiny little design optimizations that we've done um, by not being constrained to the limitations that for 100 years people needed to follow when they built aircraft, uh, we are able to create the world's best, uh, most fuel efficient cargo aircraft. And in fact, it's so good that we're not going to even sell it. We are going to uh, create a service um, and we'll start in developing countries. First of all, because that, that's where regulations are um, you know, more independent and easier to uh, tackle drone uh, flights. But also because the need is greater. You have great distances and uh, the loads aren't that big. So our solution would be perfect for um, places like Africa, uh, the Caribbean, and so on. Uh, we are working with uh, NGOs. We uh, are talking to regulators in different countries. And while we are currently constructing the full-size prototype, uh, we plan to begin service in one of these countries uh, as early as 2016. But that's just the start. Our big vision is driven by the following. It makes no sense to have a human to chaperone your stuff while it's being flown in the air. And we want to make same-day inter international delivery possible, and we want to make delivery as easy as sending an email. I've never written an, an, a paper letter in my lifetime, except for the public administration. <laughs> uh, I know that my kids would never uh, you know, have meant uh, uh, pi pilots escorting their goods whenever they get care packages or so. So this is the big vision. That's why we're delivering today. Thank you.